the ball on leg stump, trying to hit middle stump. No width can be provided. Rizwan Hussein, it's a great chance. It's an opportunity here for the uh, local Pakistan players with the likes of Ronki, Munro, Milan out of the side. They've they've left and Dale Stain as well. He's gone. Is that a catch? Is it a catch? Yes, it is. Asan Raza says it's a good catch. And Rizwan Hussein is walking back. Again, the short ball utilized well, whether it's seam up, whether it's cross seam, whether there's pace taken off the ball. This is the length we've seen the sides use here. It's just a feather. It's actually a lovely catch by Walton because he's got to dive forward. And those are never easy. But the first one. Out deep. Never took his eyes off it. Brilliant piece of fielding. And he got there too. Got there. Talk about Jubilee safe hands. Chris Jordan. That's how you do it. Well held. He got rid of Phil Salt. Who got 25. Got a start. Couldn't carry on. Some more entertainment. Now look at this projected setup. Levens. Yeah, but you've got to be smart about things. Of course, it gets harder, as you've mentioned, HD Ackerman, as the ball gets softer. Power play's done and well done and dusted. And then you uh, have to create your own pace on the ball. Batting side. Chance. Chance at mid-wicket. It's gone a long way up, but it will be held. If the car takes the catch, it was short of a length again, banged into the surface. And he's done this well in the previous game and this game, short of a length, not allowing Basu to play the horizontal back shot. If the car very comfortable underneath that Shadab didn't work today, he's out for 12. 79 for three. And with that, we've got the Tapal Taneda T strategic timeout. Well, he went for it again, and he toe ended it. This one just maybe died on him, and he almost sort of edged it back onto his stumps. Chalk, please. I want to go to just shy of three figures. Let's see. And fat this one. Really make this count this over. This will be out. This will be out. Yes, it's Delport at extra cover who takes the catch. If the has got one. Well, he tried. Just sense it and feel it. And with the uh, spinner on. And he reverse paddled him for four. He fancied having a chunk of him for six. Dancing shoes on, but he uh, mistimed it on the dance floor. Stumbled, gone. Having got a great start. Austin Tullett, 37, he's out of here. And United are 97 for four. United. Maybe this is the over. They have to target. First boundary for Ingram, who's been struggling on the surface. Mid off up in the circle. He had plenty of room to play there. Took his time, was short. It's probably set to make this over into a big one. What's he going to follow up with here? Jordan. Uh, back to it. Tried and trusted. Do you remember when Chris Jordan began his international career? He had one of the most unusual run-ups. Oh, how great way to watch a game of cricket. Just have a little cup of the pal tea. I've got those specs on <laughs> from your <laughs> lot. I'm going to change mine because I, I didn't see Mohammed Nawaz there. Sorry, Mohammed. I know, you know, great left-arm spinner you are. 
I thought you bowled pace for a moment. Mm. <laughs> the work to do. Oh, oh going to have to. Oh, Chatters. Chatters, has he done well here with the bounce throw? Back to the bowler. Come upstairs and have a little chat to Rashid Riaz. They like it, do the Kings. They're high-fiving. Oh, he's way, way gone. Chadwick Walton's done so well here, and so too is Chris Jordan. Oh, that is a huge blow. Colin Ingram, he's the man who should have been there at the end for Islamabad. He's gone for 14, it's 116 for 6. Zafar so uh Alan Wilkins just alongside me saying he saw up the under-19s recently. He's up against a uh, very experienced Chris Jordan. So uh, you like what you saw there? And uh, no, no, no. We saw him in um, we saw him in the uh, 2014 edition, Dan, in the United Arab Emirates. Oh, I'm still got to get those glasses on. <laughs> yeah, time flies, doesn't it? Scary. Oh, this is the problem here, though. There's a real miscommunication. Chadwick Walton's done well. Look at that. He knew that Colin Ingram was slow to turn and slow to go back. That's a nice piece of work by Walton and by Jordan. Presence of mind. Such a big advantage if your fast bowler can do this. Normally, from our days back in the 90s, this wasn't on. Isn't we it, Danny? Well, we're done well to catch that, really. <laughs> <laughs> Let alone dive in a victor run out. That magnitude. Oof. Yeah. It's slipping now. Ahmad Wasim's brought himself in there, creating some pressure, putting the heat on. Islamabad, they're 117 for six, and we've almost had 18. The two spinners, uh, Islamabad United, playing in the in the eleven. Zafar Gohar is one of them. Shadab, been bowling well, so but they need runs. Unless they get to somewhere around that 145 or plus mark, which highly unlikely, which is going to be difficult now to get. I don't see any chance. There's been a lack of the big ones here. There's only been one six in the innings. Two overs to go, 117 for six. Mohammed Amir. Oh, and he's got that sand shoe crusher in again. Bold. Back up, back up. One more for 200. One more for 50 and PSL for this guy. He's hunting it up. Zeroing in. So exciting to watch, Mohammed Amir. 
Fahim has got to do something here. They've, uh, they've lost Colin Ingram. He's the one man who could have. Ravel Pindi, they are here. We are ready. Oh, some swing straight away. Missing the stumps. Ranmo Martinez has got to make a call. Asking for a DRS. He's convinced his captain. Here we go, action of the first ball. He's gone for this because I think he thinks this is hitting full. Yeah. A couple of so I think the only way this will be given not yes. out is if it's pitched outside leg, I don't think it has. You can go for and if it's just clipping leg stump. Please. I'm satisfied, no bet involved. Pitching in line. Oh, smashing the leg stump. What a good call by Mohamed Amir. I absolutely misread it, as did Martinez as well. We have a decision of the first ball of the contest. Remember, Karachi Kings won the toss, decided to bowl, and what a great result. Oh! Dare I say more? Stumps demolished. What an over. Couple of great deliveries by Mohamed Amir. What a delivery. What a delivery by Mohamed Amir. Smashes the stumps over. What a start for Karachi Kings. A perfect delivery for the left arm swing pace bowler. Watch this. Beautiful seam. Nips back. Tell your story. Walk in. What a start. Given they're trying to get to some sort of total to give themselves a chance. It's been a tough innings for them. Slow ball, and it's a brilliant one. Yes, 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 superb from Mohamed Amir. He picks up his third, and it's as simple as you like. Well, it was wide above stump, but it was 114 k an hour, so good deception from the left armer. He's on song this evening. He broke the back early of Peshawar and it continues late in the piece. This is so valuable in the final five. Too easy, far too easy. And so it's 114 for five, he's gone for 25. An acceleration, largely due to Shai Malik. Wide ball, won't get away with that one. Have another go, Mohamed Amir. Three for 20 figures for the uh, Pakistani left arm magician. What do you think? 160 gets them in the game, Slats? Yeah, well, it gives them a chance, absolutely. Well, we, we feel that conditions here are suited to that score of 200, but tonight it's a different prospect. 160 would be okay. Straight up the chimney. That has gone miles up in the air. Chadwick Wharton says, leave it to me. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. He's had, hardly had to move. But that was not straightforward by any means. Huge smile on the face of the Jamaican. And why not? Magic stuff. Look at that smile. It was the dive at the end. He wants to make the classic catches. He could have just swallowed that without diving. But let's put in a dive for a little bit of fun. They just seem to get a wicket every time they need one. Carlos Brathwaite, he knew well, he doesn't move and then he has to dive swirling around even though